is she drinking? What is she trying to pick? What do you want? What's something? You want the beach chair? No, she don't. She Hi, beautiful people. Welcome to a new vlog. <laughs> I always forget to do the intro of my vlogs. And then I just start recording and then I'm like, whoa, I even welcome the people to the vlog. Like, Girl, not you spitting up on me. Look at that. Y'all see that? I don't know if y'all can see that. Baby girl. Ben Ben. But anyways, y'all. Thank you for watching. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and please subscribe and enjoy the vlog. Oh, say enjoy the vlog. Cinnamon bun. Say enjoy the vlog. No. You're just gonna spit up in money and you're not gonna say hi to the people. We're here and I'm a little late, so let's go home. I only recorded a little clip of just my face, but y'all, I never get used to the pain. It's so painful, but this time it was a little faster because the last time I did a wax was before. Literally, I got a wax on Sunday and I had my baby on Tuesday because, you know, I did not know she was coming this early and it's so crazy. But last time I did it, it was so painful. I think it's because um, the girl that did it, she was fairly new. It was so much more painful. I feel like the slower they go, the more painful it is. But, you know, the whole time she was waxing me, I'm like, I can't believe I pushed a whole baby <laughs> with no pain medic medication. And I'm out here scared of a wax. Like, girl. But it's a different type of pain, though. Like, I don't know. Every pain is different. And I feel like when it comes to um, giving birth, your body builds the um what is that hormone called oxytocin it's a hormone that your body release when you're giving birth which um assists the you with the pain but when you're getting a wax like obviously your body it's not natural um it's a pain that you're forcing upon yourself so it's very very painful but you know, we did it. I did my underarm. So I usually uh, wax my underarm. Well, babe usually wax my underarm for me. But I was just like, let me just get it get it waxed. Because it's been so long. It's been like, literally, like I said, my baby's 12 weeks now. So it's been 12 weeks since I got waxed. So, you know, it was pretty, pretty hairy. So I'm like, okay, let me just get them over with real quick. And then we good get my eyebrows threaded i have to show you all the before yo i'm losing my voice and i don't like that i was a burning and watering y'all because i'm like holding it shut oh i should have went i have to make a u-turn but uh, how do we feel about it it's my first time going to this place because i usually go to the 13th station at the mall i think they have it at almost every mall but, ooh, lighting. My eyes are burning. Anyways, I'm gonna just show you. I like. It's fine without the jacket. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, if you want to come right next here. Why is it recording? I was taking some pictures. This girl was crying. Ain't let nobody record. Okay, what am I doing right here? At a big ass park. Come here. And this girl is under this thing feeding. Look at look at her little legs. See? Now she's she quiet because she's eat. eating. She eating. <sighs> she wasn't even operating. This now so we're carrying. My key is loose in there. I hope it don't fall somewhere. <coughs> Excuse me. You know what I call that? White bushes. She locks likes to do. This is what she likes to do. White bushes. Things that black people don't be doing. Right, Lux? Yeah. Yeah, see? 
that's how you that's how you mm. live life mm -hmm. y'all just be going to the club mm -hmm. party yeah. work club yeah. party that's where it's at partying barbecue yes you need things that feeds your soul mm. like barbecuing no like, like eating. going in nature we are nature we don't need to go out and taking anymore. a deep breath you've been breathing there's no point of <laughs> <laughs> you've been breathing right look 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 this part look. See that? You need things that makes you feel alive, not just partying. I mean, it's, I think it's yeah. a balance. You know what else makes you feel alive? Imagine, right? You're driving, doing like 120. Your heart beating so fast. You know how you know how alive you feel? <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Dude. It doesn't make sense. No. Nope. You don't feel alive. I'm, I'm talking about things that bring you peace. That doesn't. It doesn't that's bring you peace. That's not. I mean, you feel alive. You say things that make you feel alive. Mm. Peace. Peace is like when, what, when you're not home and I'm laying down, sleeping peacefully. Wow. See that? <laughs> you hear that, man, man? This is a big ass tree, though. Y'all yeah. wanna see me climb a tree? You done? Just finish our photo shoot. Huh? What about you? Oh. <laughs> We're on our way back. <sighs> well, we're going to my parents' house. But hopefully the pictures came out all right because Cinnamon Bun was hungry, so she was crying almost the whole time. Like, have you been here before? Us? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Is it place by your house like this? Are we coming from the beach? Yeah, but that's on the other side. So See her in the back. Show her my view. Show her my view lock since you're holding the camera. Oh. You. Can't barely see. It's not focusing. It's not focusing. You see her little head in the mirror in the back? <laughs> right there. It's not focusing here. This place has a lot of cute places. I feel like every, like every main town in Long Island has a village. And then the villagers be having little cute restaurants, cute places. What they call white people things. I don't know why you're using filter. What say, filter? Say, it, say it how it is. When you're in the, them little white people area, right? Okay, but they're That's cute. Like, okay, okay, just say it how it is. Okay. Don't, don't be like them little area. Like you in a white, you in a white people in their area. Okay, but the way to put it is, if you're in Atlanta, right? There's a lot of cute, there's a lot of lit places, but like it's ma mainly like. African American black people places, or like when you're in Houston, a lot of the lit places are like black people places. But when you're in Long Island, since it's a what do they call a suburb, there's little villages that would be like if it was a, a city city, it would mostly be um black people, right? Like yeah. the hookah lounges, the lounges, the cute little places. But since we live in Long Island, it's a lot of white people, um. Which is fine, like, I've never experienced any type of racism here. Mm. Not like, you know, in your face type thing. You know, people have their little side eye. <laughs> but when it comes to, like, making you feel some type of way, there, I've never kind of really experienced that. And I've been living here since I came from Haiti when I was nine years old. Guess what? What? Me? Going to your town since I delivered for FedEx and Amazon and all them shit. You've experienced Going racism. to your town, just driving, you see them little niggas running inside, closing their doors like you're coming to rob them and shit. They're racist. I've never, maybe because I don't, I don't know. They be driving I'm mad fast, sell, they be baby. driving mad fast and, and, and then telling you to slow down. Yeah, that's true. They be having the little slow down things that they put outside. You know what I'm talking about? The yellow signs. And they be the ones driving fast as hell? Yeah. You know what this old lady did? Mm. To the, like, to a company that I used to work. So the guy was delivering, right? Mm -hmm. So he stopped, like, because she just walked in front of the truck. He stopped, like, they even hit her at all. Guess what she did? <laughs> she fell down. She she she, she she purposely walked in front in front of the thing. The guy stopped because he saw her. 
She dropped on the floor. Was but was crying, called called nine one one and shit. And then they they didn't know like the cops. Was, some of them were not stupid. Mm -hmm. Obviously, she wasn't hit. And the trucks have camera. And she didn't get the lawsuit or anything. And guess what happened to the guy still? Still got fired. He got fired. The guy loses his job for no reason. But you know those are the Karens, and that's everywhere. Even like in the South, or like anywhere. Coconut Greek. You're gonna have to play by yourself. You know, you know how to only, play pool? Only if we don't know how to take money. I guess. Huh? What do you mean if only you how to take money? <laughs> what is that go, supposed to mean? To she knows how to take money, right? <laughs> Don't you need diapers? You know how to take money? And wipes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're now. Look, 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 look. You see? She's waiting for you. Vite, vite, where's the photo of her friend? Come here, huh? Lock them lines, you're a boy, man. Shake my head. I remember when Katu had one of those. She still has it. She still has that for the damn. That's good. What's going on, YouTube? Yep. I look good. I ain't tripping. My head, dude. Child. That's good. <laughs> She was looking at cars for my hands. What is she trying to pick? What do you want? Pick something. You want the beach chair? No, she don't. She was excited to see something, which the princess removed that out of the way. What are you looking at? The little life vest. You should get her one before we go to Florida. She gonna be in Miami, living it up. <laughs> look at look how cute. <laughs> it's so tiny. Mm -hmm. Tiny, probably too big for me. Yeah, it says thirty three pounds. Mm. What do you want? She's not picking anything. That's because she doesn't want anything. Do you guys want anything? The YouTube fan. <laughs> they want they want some shit they could they could dig sand with. I'm gonna go to the pool and shit. She's like, nope. What are you looking at? What do you see? Whatever it is. All the toys that you're gonna be able to play with soon. You excited? I think she's trying to buy me a basketball. That's what she's looking at. I'm telling you. Where is it? See right there? That's what she was looking at. I'm buying everybody something. Mm. Maybe she wants a dog. We want to know all about your day here today. Can you buy some dog supplies? Did you buy some dog supplies? Does she look French? The other outfit made her look. We had to change her outfit, but. Yeah, the other outfit made her look French. Wee, wee, wee. C'est quoi ça, hein? Miss, when is my voice gonna be fully back? Hmm? What you gotta say? It's only four dollars. Excuse it. That's what she gotta say. They're cute. That's gonna fit her. Zero, yeah, zero to twelve months. But she has so many pink socks. So I guess, I guess something that's not pink then. I like these socks, but I can't find them without, without this whole dress thing. But I like these socks, though. Tell me. But I don't want, I don't want this shit, though. These, what are these? Maybe, maybe she needs some bra. You think she needs some bra? She needs, she needs a bra, right? Yeah. Look, she's looking at the big girl dresses. Mm. Big girl outfit. Sweet babies. They're so pretty. She's gonna be in her little dress. Mm-hmm. Locked up in the tower like like Rapunzel. Rapunzel? Mm -hmm. Never get out. 
pour pas chez mal ou nèg hmm on va lock up in the tower 